see what our luck is. Ooh, rerun. Already a rerun? It's already, it's only day nine of the first season. Help a bitch out. Okay, all I got is leeks and acorns. And you're teaching me how to cook this shit that does not matter. All right. Hey. I want it to rain. Ooh, I see a glimmer within my scrying orb. A shard of knowledge from the future. The spirits feel neutral today. The day is in your hand. Yeah. Okay, it's only 620. I'm not gonna be an asshole and go run to Robin's and then not even be able to do anything like I typically usually do. <laughs> I wonder if any of our hearts have increased. Oh! We got a heart with Sophia. Got a heart with Sophia. Got a heart with Sophia. Maybe we'll get lucky and she'll stop treating us like a social outcast, okay? Listen, if she can freaking cry in front of us, I feel like we definitely are already close. Well, maybe she does that with everybody. Social anxiety. I get it. Hey, pup, you want this stick? You can have it. I don't want it. I do actually want it. I'm sorry. I gotta build some things. Do you want chicken brothers or do you not want chicken brothers? But you can't kill the chicken brothers, okay? It's for money. Eight, ten. Okay, after I cut this tree down, we're gonna go to Robin's and demand that she make a coop for us. Oh yeah, true. Oh, the butterflies. That's cute. It's a sign. I don't know what's a sign for necessarily, but definitely a sign, I think. I know the old ancient scrolls have always said, if you cut down a tree and the butterflies escape it, you will yield a funky crop. <clears throat> um, where are we gonna put our coop at? Hmm. Should I just like put it right here for now? Since I haven't really like, um, like cleared out a lot of space. I don't know if I really like it that close, but it doesn't matter because we can always move it in the future. I just kind of want it easily accessible. Cause I can't really clear out much anyway. Do you see how freaking quick my energy drops, dude? I'm pretty sure I'm anemic or something. I wish there was a uh, animation for every single time my person stand up and just passed out and then I have to go to Harvey and he's like, uh, I don't think you're actually cut out to be a farmer if you keep passing out all the time. All right, Robin, get your worker's fingers ready. No, not like that, Robin. Stop coming on to me. What did he say? Hey. Oh. All right, Robin, you've decided to come to work today. Proud of you. Uh, construct. What, it's 4,000 gold? Bruh. Well, fuck me then. Jeez, what am I made of money? What do you want me to do? <sighs> ah, Robin, Robin, no. I only have 2,000. Punch in the air right now, Robin! I'm trying to get some freaking hens out here! You dumb bitch. Lower your prices in this economy! God damn it, Robin! Fine! Fine! And look at my energy! I'm basically gonna die! Let's go say hey to Linus, and I swear if he accuses me of trying to attack him again, I will attack him! I don't know you well enough to trust you. Sorry. <laughs> he probably heard. <laughs> Screaming about assaulting him as I walked up. You better tell me, hey, I'm gonna punch you, old man. <laughs> How many times do we gotta teach you this lesson, old man? <laughs> Look at Linus. He started it okay. I was perfectly okay. With Linus, I had no problem. And then he started treating me like a criminal. And then I was like, you know what? Maybe I am a criminal. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> Get out of here. Oh uh, yeah, oh uh, yeah. Okay, we need a dandelion. Let me just check everything else. I'm pretty sure everything else is... Oh, shit. I could 
totally do 99 wood though because I need only 300. Do I really gotta click 99 times? All right, boys, everyone take a nap. Yeah, all right, I'm just, I'm just collecting wood. Just just type wood in the chat if you want me to go get wood. Psych! <laughs> all right, there we go. Nice, not bad, okay. So look, we did more than we even thought we could. I'm so proud of us. Don't have those things. Okay, none of that. So we can actually get some of those winter things in like the winter levels in the um the mines. So not bad. We'll be able to do that too. All right. A little off track. My brain just like was. <laughs> I would start thinking about Olivia and Jody. Let me go see this slut. What did you say? It's twelve ten p.m. already. My goodness. I still have tons of work to do. I haven't hate crimed anyone today. Wow, Jody. <laughs> Did you watch the game last night? What was it? Oh wait, do you even have a TV set? Shut your bitches! Okay, I'm gonna walk away from this conversation. You're just like your mother. Hey, it's your boy, uh, Victor. Uh. Oh, I never noticed a little gaming set. That's cute. A uh, hi. Can I help you? Yeah, you can help me by losing the attitude, dude. You want some slime? No. Fine. Fine. I'll keep all the slime to myself. You'll never get into the Adventurer's Guild with that kind of attitude, buddy. Where's Olivia? She must be out and about being fabulous somewhere. She is literally... A feminist icon. I love her so much. Let's go to Gunter. We gotta get him to crack some of these geodes open. See what he, uh, what, what kind of crappy things come out of it. Hey, my boy. Ooh, but at least we know all of these things are gonna be new. We can donate them to the library. Go it, nick it. Uh, granite. Some more rock. Okay, that's it. Bye. Wait, maybe I should just tell him. Hey, we gotta remember that we can't just like do services from them. I have to talk to them too. Hey, what do you need? A friend. Just a sympathetic ear, someone to hug, you know? I'm a simple woman. I want simple things. World peace. All right, okay. Boring. Nice, all right. Dang, I was really hoping we were gonna get a reward for that. I really pulled through, come on. Abigail. Hey, we had one of those sap shoes sewn at the shop for dinner last night. I guess it was starting to go bad and my dad couldn't bear to throw it out. Unfortunately, it tasted like trash. Hey, sorry in advance if I say anything rude. I didn't get much sleep last night. Were you throwing up sap all night? Because actually it makes me sick too when I eat it. Miss Kinney says I have to read this book before I can go play. Oh, look at his little face. Mm. You want me to beat up Penny for you? I'll do it. Hey, what's up, man? Long time no talk. Nice to hear from you. Thank you for coming and hang out with me. I'm bullying children. We don't have a school here, but I'm doing my best to give Vincent and Jess a proper education. I feel like uh, Penny is one of those girls that like she says she's trying to educate children, but it's all like evangelical information and she's like, okay, evolution isn't real. <laughs> Don't do like just weird stuff. And like the kids start talking and you're like, Penny, what have, what have you been teaching the children? Um, Jazz was talking about pipe bombs the other day. I, I don't know. <laughs> What's up, girl? 
She's like the only smart kid. She's like, why are you talking to me? You're a grown woman. Like, that's weird. What is this? Oh, shit. Okay. All right. Leah and Elliot. What are you guys doing? Talking some artsy stuff, huh? huh? Bouncing some ideas off of each other. Having a glass of wine. <laughs> Getting inspired. Remember when Leah told us to ignore the banging in her house? It's just her um, making sculptures. I don't know about that. Elliot, have you seen her sculptures? Oh, yeah. Tell me. The fresh air from the sea ignites my passion to write. <laughs> The fresh air. Okay, well, pfft, redundant. Shut up. Leah, feel the ocean breeze on your face. Okay, well, you guys suck, so. Oh, okay. So, oh, wait, we need a dandelion. I think I should probably try to get that. Oh, wait, let's go. This is in uh, existing. Ooh, trilobite. I think. Yeah, that is new. We could go bring that to the library. I swear, if he doesn't reward me, I'm going to stop bringing things to the library and I'm going to start selling them on Amazon Prime. Dried starfish. Ooh, I think that would actually be kind of a cool little gift. Ooh. Look how cute Sophia is. <gasps> so adorable, dude. I'm hungry. Would you like some clam? Okay, let's give her the starfish because she is the first person I want to romance. Mm. I love her. She's beautiful. She cosplays. She plays uh, nerdy games. That's adorable. Here you go. Oh, oh crap. She hates it. Abort mission. <laughs> and like, she's one of my favorite mods, but also hot mom uh, Olivia. Bruh. I am so actually excited that she's a single mom and you're actually allowed to try to date her. <laughs> oh wait, don't go through the garbage in front of Alex. <laughs> I almost just like dumpster dived in front of him. And he would have been like, that's not very uh, body positive, healthy of you. <laughs> hey kid, you're too young to be moping around in a place like this. Bruh. Shut up, Pam. I will wrestle your ass to the ground. Treat your daughter better. Go into recovery. What is wrong with you? Spending some time in the old community center. It's good taking care of that place. Hell yeah, I'm gonna own this town. Look at his little mustache, guys. How handsome. Oh, if I could electively have a mustache, even as a woman, I probably would, maybe. I don't know. I feel like it would make other people more uncomfortable than, than I would be uncomfortable with it because I would definitely become a bank robber <laughs> if I had a mustache like that. <laughs> Yummy. Have fun. Come back, though, and definitely check in again. I love hearing from you, dude. So much fun. I've heard rumors of rare and powerful magic rings forged long ago. Yes, I actually have a glowstone. Thank you, Jesus. Or Yabo or whatever <laughs> their god is. Shane. No, I don't have time to chat with you. Just for that, I'm going to be extremely nice to you. Let's buy Shane a beer. I don't care if I was trying to save it. I am going to force him to be best friends with me. Oh, wow. Toki, how'd you know this is my favorite? Wow. Really get him liquored up and his attitude very much changes. Okay, Shane. See how it is, you freaking alcoholic. What's up, you love birds? Let's get out of here. I don't want to interrupt anything. <laughs> Is Olivia back home? I didn't get to talk to her yet, and I very much want to see her beautiful, luscious. What are you doing back here, Pierre? Hi, Toki. I'm storing products in my shopping bin. Louis will pick all of them up tomorrow morning. 
<laughs> I love it when they answer me as if they actually heard me say my real life commentary. <laughs> Listen, there is something about Pierre though I kind of wish we could date. He's with Caroline, but I'm pretty positive Abigail is not his daughter. The T, I know, piping hot. Let's just talk about the community gossip, okay? So I'm pretty sure Abigail, our local um, pick me girl, I want to slap her. I feel like I would meet her in person and be like, oh my God, we're totally gonna be friends. And then the more she talks to me, I'm like, I need to back out of this friendship. I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go. All right, I don't really want to hang out with you anymore. But, you know, if, if you and Caroline any time decide that, you know, they might want to get a divorce because uh, all this gossip comes out, I will be there to comfort him. Whatever. All right, everyone play it cool. Everyone shut up. Shut up. Everyone be quiet. What's up, Olivia? What's up, girl? You just hanging out? Just doing some house stuff. Sheesh. Don't worry, girl. I'm here to make your day. Hi, sweetie. Happy Wednesday. <gasps> Olivia, don't look at me in the eyes. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Olivia, stop. <laughs> You should build a pool, Olivia, and I can be your pool girl. Okay? Maybe if you're lucky. Oh. Whoa! 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 Olivia, don't look at me like that. Oh, oh my god, Olivia, don't look at me like that. Oh. Whew, I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out a little bit, Olivia. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> Olivia, you want to share some aged wine with me? I like, you know. I always say. I mean, here we go. Give me that, Olivia. Let's leave. We, okay, we got we to gotta leave while we're ahead. Just leave while we're ahead. I don't want to embarrass ourselves. Uh, wh what does Olivia actually love? Oh, pink cake, golden relic, relic, wine, pearl. Okay. Look, is anyone around? No, we're clear. Damn it! I haven't gotten anything good. Oh. Georgia Cola, well, I really don't want to get, um, you know, an illness from drinking someone's soda can. What do you want? Shut your bitch ass! Okay, damn, ornery. <laughs> Dewey, he was only a cat, but he was human enough to be a great comfort in hours of loneliness and pain. Oh, you guys, Victor was here the other day and he was reading this gravestone and I was like, oh, who, who is he looking at? Who is he coming visit? It was his cat. That's so sad. Oh, Victor. What a sweet guy. Oh, not good. Yep, yep. Yeah, I miss him too. Aww. Oh, we also haven't found a dandelion. Dude, if y'all see a dandelion, please let me know. I don't want to miss it. We only need one more dandelion to complete one of the bundles. It'll be our first bundle together. Congratulations. This dude. 
Uh, we never saw each other. You didn't see me here. I don't want to go all the way over there and waste all that time, but also that's probably where the dandelion is. It's wherever I don't want to go. Radish? Oh, yeah. It is radish. Wow, look at the glow ring go, right? Totally beneficial. Imagine if we had a glow ring on every finger. We could go to Olivia's house and it could be a light show. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Ah, Olivia! I'm so sorry, that was disgusting. I take it back. We could go this way too. Oh god, so dark. What oh, is hard to Hey, we got one! Okay, let's go. Time to go to bed. We hit our accomplishment. We got the dandelion. It's gonna complete the bundle. We're already owning this community. I kind of wish that um crimes would happen and I'd have to solve them. <laughs> Maybe that can be a mod eventually. <laughs> Whenever I become best friends with everyone, they start trusting me to solve their crimes. <laughs> it has to be Joe Jamart, though, behind all the crimes. They're just, like, paying to have hits on Pierre to get the competition out of the way. <laughs> I wish I knew how to mod. I would definitely do a crime mod for this. Wow. Let's go sell some stuff. Yeah, we did make sure to water our things. Good, 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 good. Uh, yes, yes, no, yes, 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 yes. Get that garbage out of here. Um, and the sap. I don't really need the sap. We're gonna bring this to the library tomorrow. I wonder if we'll get a little, um, reward. Finders keepers. Pet our dog. Tell him we love him. I literally almost chopped our dog's head off. Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Eesh, no one call no one call services on me, okay? It wasn't on purpose. He's fine. Don't call anyone. Day 10 of spring, year one. Oh, look at our cute little house. I love that. My back be hurting. <laughs> okay. Living off the land. Woes from crows? No, I don't have that many crops. <laughs> Partially cloudy with a light touch of pollen. Uh oh! Morning, Toki. Just dropped by to warn you about those crows flying about. I woke up to see them flocking over my crop field. Had to scare a few off. Hmm. I think your farm is fine. I live right by that forest, so I get a lot of them roosting in the trees. Darn crows. <gasps> yep, there they are, darn scavengers. But looks like they ain't nibbling actual crops like they did mine. Maybe because they know who's boss. It'd be a good idea to build more of them square crows if you can. Might not be a bad idea to build a few myself. I'll go get started. Good luck, firm. Okay. See, you know, a little suspicious is all, is all I'm going to say. Why is he worried about me noticing the crows? Does he care about my crops and them being attacked by crows? Or... Did he drop a dead body somewhere and he doesn't want me to be alarmed? by the crows scavenging we'll see i don't trust him is all i'm saying missing i lost my favorite axe if you find it please return asap i'm having a tough time without it there's 250 gold in it forever who for whoever finds the thing robin yeah for sure i already know where it is so it shouldn't be too bad unless it's like a something that they like alternate where they put it i don't think so find the axe after we water this, I can't forget. I need to be able to get some money from these crops. We're poor. We can't even afford a coop yet. What's wrong with us? Everyone's going to laugh at us. It is typically this way. So let's see. 
Ooh, we got a heart with Shane. Eh. Okay. So typically the axe is over down here. I think it's a it's like just a mechanic to try to force you to go down here, really. I hope it's still there it is. Let's give it to Robin, which means we'll get some money. <laughs> we did, we found it, okay? Anything we could forge over here, and we're gonna go bring uh, some of these things that we got to the community center. Look at this dump. Ugh, gross. Oh no. Oh wait, I think I know who comes drink here. Oh man, the feels pretty sad. Don't even want to think about it. No. Th um, we can go this way. I don't really go this way that often, but I kind of want to. A leak. Grandpa loves leeks. And we haven't been giving him much. It's actually kind of fun to be friends with George. It's nice to be the only person that someone who hates everyone likes. <laughs> Ooh, good foraging. Eh, wait, let me. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Okay. We got some broken fence over here. So this is this like little thing that I'm guessing we're eventually gonna be able to fix up. I don't, this isn't in the original game. So I'm not sure what triggers that activity or the ability to be able to fix it. Make sure there's nothing over here. Oh, how far does this go over here? Jeez. Is it just a tree line? Let me make sure. Can you go over there? What? Is this like a sneaky spot? What the heck? What's going on? Whoa! Hey! What is this? Oh my goodness! What is this? This is... This? Okay, so we have a maple syrup and that is actually something we need for the community center? But what is this? Oh, I can't go there. Dang, dang. Whatever, we got maple syrup. Eh, getting saucy. Can you go that way? No, it's just a little uh, aesthetic spot. Just collecting some uh, grass starter material. No, no problem. Can we go over here? No, okay. Fine, fine, fine. Let me not let me not get in over my head, okay? I'm glad we got the maple though, because we're gonna be able to put that in the community center, which is like mm, beautiful. I love doing that. Go back in. I don't think anything's changed or anything. Oh, I love how the light looks. Oh, we could grab this, I think. Yes, and we get to bring that to uh the library. Oh yeah, that's true, that's true, that's true. That's true. Revter's company? What's that? I don't know. Maybe that's just something in here. Oh, this kind of looks like um the little hut that the Junimos use. I wonder if that's gonna be like part of it. So much grass. Definitely don't have the patience to clear all this out. Okay, so let me look at what we got, okay, we're gonna bring this to the library, this to the library, this to Robin, this to the community center. We could bring Grandpa Leek, cause we're nice like that. I wish we had something that Sophia really liked, but all of the stuff that she's really into is not like readily accessible things. So uh, we're gonna have to give her stuff that she just like partially is into. Where's the exit to this? Oh my God, we're stuck here forever. Oh! What? Ew, it smells. Why is it locked? I wanna explore the sewers. Why is no one watching these children? <laughs> you guys are gonna get like radiation. Master Splinter is gonna come out and punch you in the throat, dude. Like, please be careful. I 
I think Marlin has the key. Marlin? The man who owns monsters? Why do you think he has it? I saw a big rusty old key fell, fall out of his pocket one time. A creepy sewer door like this has just got to be a match for a big rusty old key. I mean, that's a good argument. I'm not gonna disagree. I'm just like watching these kids play in sewer. There's something moving around in there. I just punch my way through it like a savage. I'm actually a master picklock because I am in fact a criminal for extra cash. <laughs> Okay, wow, that was actually an unexpected cinematic. Um, I don't even know if I got that in my regular playthrough because I never really made it a point to be close to the children. Uh, because even though it is a game, it's still like, why would an adult be hanging out with kids? <laughs> well, obviously they need some kind of adult supervision. They're freaking playing in sewage. You see, what am I supposed to do with that? It will not let me, it will not let me go into his house. Bruh, I don't know how to fix that actually. Ugh, I don't know how to fix it. No, get back, you hussy. Okay, it's 320. I really gotta hurry up and go do some of this stuff before everyone close shop, dude. Leah, what's up, baby girl? There's actually a lot of wild food in this area if you knew where to look. You wanna go on a picnic date? I love you, you're cute. Stay out the sewer, I'm telling your mom. I don't have a mother. True. <laughs> Yeesh. <laughs> okay, Robin, old man, library. Let's do the library first, it's more I don't think, yeah, I think it's probably gonna be closed by the time I get there. <gasps> Damn it, me and my interest. Sam, being all introspective. I like it, keep it up. We like an intellectual man. Okay, cool, we made it. Please, everyone, fingers crossed he gives us something, okay? Yay! Let's put the weird doll thing over here because that is creepy. <laughs> What's our reward? Okay. What do we think the reward is going to be? Probably the most lame thing you could think of. So he'll probably give me like a horseradish. Even though there's like a thousand growing for free. Back at it again. Melon seeds. We like a good set of melons. I oh, yeah. I can very confidently say that. Let's go give George this. Maybe it'll help his high blood pressure because I know that dude is one step from a cardiac arrest at all times. You yell too much, George. Boom. <gasps> this is my favorite thing. Thank you. You're welcome. I know. I stalk you. Bye. Hi. I'll be baking cookies today. I like to make flower shapes in the spring. <laughs> Give me your cookie recipe, old lady. <laughs> What's up, Penny? Done educating the children? You got any pink cakes? What you got? Blueberry tart? Your mom's a tart. I'm out. I wonder if we'll still be able to go um, to Robin. Like you want your axe or not, Robin. Maru, you're looking good. Just got off of work. I plan on spending a lot of time with my telescope this summer. Ooh, just girlfriends stargazing. I'm not even talking to you, Abigail. I hate you, you're stupid. Goodbye. Oh wait, wait. Wait, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. We gotta go put the dandelion in. Oh my god. We almost totally missed completing one of our bundles. You guys, why didn't you remind me? What's wrong with you? Come on, come on, come on. 
We're in this together, guys. Do you wanna beat corporate America or? <gasps> Yay! Congrats. Good job, guys. What is our present? disappointing <laughs> oh wait Ooh, so it opened up a new set we could go see what's in there hopefully we'll be able to start adding stuff to there because i think it's to do more with like animals and livestock and stuff let's see oh oh and we could start doing fishing stuff maybe we should do that before the night is over go do some fishing we have a good bit of energy and we really could use the money. We should be planning some stuff too. Ugh. Okay, none of these. Everybody got cauliflower and green beans. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. So these are new. Uh, Cause I added husbandry. So that means we could actually kill the animals and get uh, meat from them. All right, okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We could put the maple somewhere, right? Let's go see. Not here. Not there. Not there. Oh, yeah, here we go. Nice. So that takes care of one of the exotic foraging. Mm. Hi, little Junimo. Let's go see if uh, Robin will let us in. Robin, I've collected your things. No, I didn't steal it. I simply found it. I didn't kill anyone with it. It is not a murder weapon now, I promise. Pinky promise. I have these two pinkies that I cut off in my pocket. I mean, what did he say? I never said anything. <laughs> Robin, you're crazy. Me? Oh, I never. Hey, you found my axe. What a release. Almost chopped my... What? Robin? Robin? Did we just bond over mutilation? <gasps> mutilation sisters! Robin! You sick woman! I love it. Good job, Robin. Keep it up. You keep being weird, girl. You keep being weird. If you need me to throw that axe in the lake later, let me know, baby. <laughs> let me know. I'll do it just for you. I'll do it with you, too. You didn't hear that from me. Don't tell Sebastian. I still love him. <laughs>